the stock market can feel like a whirlwind of numbers and graphs, constantly shifting and evolving. But understanding its trends is key to making smart investment decisions. It's not just about the numbers, it's about the story they tell. Think of it like predicting the weather. You check for patterns, analyze data, and then decide whether to carry an umbrella. The same principles apply to the stock market. Similarly, analyzing market trends helps you decide when to buy, sell, or hold stocks. It's about timing and understanding the market's rhythm. It's about making informed choices to grow your wealth. Every decision you make should be backed by thorough research and analysis. Just like you wouldn't jump into a swimming pool without checking the depth, don't invest without understanding the market. Preparation is key. By learning how to analyze trends, you gain valuable insights. These insights can guide your investment strategy and help you avoid potential pitfalls. These insights empower you to navigate the stock market with confidence. Confidence comes from knowledge and preparation. Remember, knowledge is power, especially when it comes to your financial well-being. The more you know, the better equipped you are to make sound investment decisions. Attend seminars, read books, and stay updated with the latest market news. Continuous learning is essential in the ever-changing world of finance. Regularly review your portfolio and consult with financial advisors to ensure your investment strategy aligns with your financial goals. Before investing in a company, it's crucial to understand its financial health. This means diving deep into the numbers and metrics that tell the story of the company's performance and potential. This is where fundamental analysis comes in. It's a method that helps investors evaluate a company's intrinsic value by examining related economic, financial, and other qualitative and quantitative factors. Think of it as checking a company's report card before deciding if it's a good investment. Just like in school, a good report card indicates strong performance and potential for future success. We look at factors like revenue and profit growth. These metrics show how well the company is generating sales and managing its expenses over time. Are they increasing steadily? That's a good sign. Consistent growth in revenue and profit suggests that the company is on a solid path and has a sustainable business model. Next, we consider earnings per share or EPS. This metric tells us how much profit the company is making for each share you own giving a clear picture of profitability on a per share basis. A higher EPS generally indicates a more profitable company. It means the company is effectively converting its revenue into actual profit, which is a positive indicator for investors. The price to earnings or PE ratio is also essential. This ratio compares the company's stock price to its earnings, helping investors determine if the stock is overvalued or undervalued. A high P.E. ratio could mean the stock is overvalued, suggesting that investors are expecting high growth rates in the future. However, it could also indicate that the stock is overpriced relative to its earnings. Conversely, a low P.E. ratio might suggest that the stock is undervalued, potentially offering a bargain for investors if the company has strong fundamentals. Finally, we examine the debt to equity ratio. This ratio shows how much debt the company uses to finance its operations compared to its equity. A high ratio might indicate higher risk as the company relies heavily on borrowed money, which could be problematic if it faces financial difficulties. On the other hand, a lower ratio suggests that the company is using less debt and is potentially more stable and less risky. By understanding these fundamental metrics, investors can make more informed decisions and choose companies that are likely to provide good returns over the long term. Technical analysis is like reading the story. The stock market is telling through charts and patterns. It's a method that allows traders and investors to make sense of the seemingly chaotic price movements by identifying trends and potential future movements. It focuses on the stock's price movements and trading volume. By analyzing these elements, we can gain insights into the market's behavior and make more informed trading decisions. One tool we use is moving averages. These lines on a chart smooth out price fluctuations, making it easier to identify trends. Moving averages come in different types, such as simple moving averages, SMA, 
and Exponential Moving Averages, EMA, each offering unique insights into the stock's performance. The Relative Strength Index, or RSI, is another helpful tool. It measures the speed and change of price movements. RSI helps traders determine whether a stock is in an overbought or oversold condition, which can be crucial for timing trades. An RSI above 70 might suggest the stock is overbought, while below 30 could indicate it's oversold. This information can help traders decide when to enter or exit a position, potentially maximizing their gains or minimizing losses. Bollinger Bands are lines plotted around the stock's price. They help us understand price volatility and potential breakouts. The bands expand and contract based on market volatility, providing visual cues about the stock's price behavior. Lastly, we look for support and resistance levels. These are price points where the stock tends to reverse direction. Identifying these levels can help traders set target prices and stop loss orders, enhancing their trading strategy and risk management. Let's look at real-time examples from the Indian stock market. Infosys, a leading IT company, has shown consistent revenue and profit growth in recent years. Its EPS has also been increasing, indicating strong financial performance. HDFC Bank, a major private sector bank, has a strong track record of dividend payments and a healthy loan book. Its fundamentals are generally considered solid. However, always remember that past performance is not necessarily indicative of future results. Section 5. Nifty 50 and Sensex, gauging the market's pulse. The Nifty 50 and Sensex are benchmark indices of the National Stock Exchange, or NSE, and Bombay Stock Exchange, or BSE, respectively. They represent the performance of the top companies listed on these exchanges. Analyzing their trends provides insights into the overall market sentiment. When both indices are rising, it indicates a bullish market sentiment, while a decline suggests bearish sentiment. These indices are crucial barometers for investors to understand the broader market direction. Section 6. The Power of Combined Analysis Fundamental and Technical to make well-informed investment decisions, it's crucial to combine both fundamental and technical analysis. Fundamental analysis gives you a strong foundation by evaluating a company's financial health. Technical analysis adds another layer of insight by studying price trends and patterns. Think of it like this. Fundamental analysis tells you if the company is a good car, while technical analysis helps you decide the right time to buy that car. By combining both approaches, you gain a comprehensive view of the stock and its potential. Section 7. Mastering the Market A journey of continuous learning. Remember, the stock market is constantly evolving. What worked yesterday might not work tomorrow. Therefore, continuous learning is crucial for long-term success. There are numerous resources available to enhance your knowledge. Attend webinars, read books, follow reputable financial websites, and consider taking online courses. The more you learn, the better equipped you'll be to navigate the complexities of the stock market. Section 8. Your stock market journey begins now. Don't be overwhelmed by the information. Start by focusing on one or two analysis techniques at a time. As you gain confidence, gradually incorporate more tools and strategies. Remember, even seasoned investors started somewhere. The most important step is to begin your learning journey today. The sooner you start, the sooner you can start making informed investment decisions. Section 9. Subscribe, engage and thrive in the market. Stay updated with the latest market trends and analysis by subscribing to relevant channels. Follow financial experts, join investment communities, and engage in discussions. Learning from others' experiences can be invaluable. Remember, investing is not a solitary pursuit. By connecting with others, you can gain different perspectives, share knowledge, and learn from each other's successes and mistakes.
Section 10. Unlocking Financial Success. Your path to informed investing. Analyzing stock market trends is an empowering skill that can significantly enhance your investment journey. By understanding both fundamental and technical analysis, you gain the knowledge to make informed decisions, manage risks, and potentially maximize your returns. Remember, investing is a marathon, not a sprint. Be patient, stay informed, and never stop learning. The world of stock market investing awaits, and with the right knowledge and approach, you can unlock its potential for financial success.